Well, summer break is here. Parents, how are you holding up so far? I know this time of year can be really stressful when you're trying to juggle kids or adults at home. Maybe a job too, while making this time at home really fun and workable with all schedules. But imagine the additional stress that can come for many parents trying to make sure that those with different intellectual or developmental abilities are also being taken care of and having some fun. So giving up your kids to summer camps, oh, it can be scary enough for some parents. But when your child or adult also needs a little extra attention and care, things may even get a little more unclear. Many times those opportunities require long trips or lots of money or separate care from what other kids are doing too. But this morning, we are breaking that, and these things change with a new summer camp. So joining me live, actually a St. Joe alum, Kaylee Sexton Leonard with the Logan Center. Thank you guys so much for yeah. waking up with me. Thanks for having me. Well, hey, this morning, of course, first, congratulations on 75 years. Thank you, almost, yep. yeah. Yeah, Logan Center, doing big things yep. this year. Yeah, thanks. And for anybody who is starting out, maybe hasn't met the Logan Center just yet, what is it that you yeah. guys do? Yeah, so we provide uh, programs and resources to children and adults with um, intellectual and developmental disabilities. And that's something we're starting to see and how you're serving with this wellness camp. Yeah. Tell me yeah. what our families can expect. Yeah, so um, we have started our summer camp up back at Hannah and Friends, um, one of Logan's locations. So it is a Monday through Thursday summer camp, your traditional summer camp, um, nine to three. And we offer so many different fun and exciting activities, inside activities, outdoor activities, scavenger hunts, walks, treasure hunts, things like that. So like anything really that you would want to be having yes. fun with at a camp. Yeah. Yes. What are some of those highlights? Because all of these weeks are themed, is that correct? Yes, so all the weeks are themed. Um, we started the first week of June. So the first week was fun and fitness. We've had a music week. Um, there is a safari week coming up. There's a Be A Star week coming up. So limo rides, um, we'll have a magician out. We had a face painter out. I believe some of those pictures were on the screen. Um, so lots of really fun guests from our community um, and really exciting activities. Because I love that you're not only involving the community with all of this, but for people at home, you may or may not know, I have an older brother who has cerebral palsy. His name is Christian. So I kind of grew up with yeah. someone who's a little differently yeah. abled. And I've learned and seen how these camps and things can really help yeah. families and siblings too. And you guys are actually bringing the siblings into yes. this. Tell me yep. how that's working. Yep. So this camp is, is offered to siblings as well. Um, so it's an experience for siblings to come, get dropped off with, with their sibling, um, and enjoy camp just like everybody else. So um, lots of really fun traditional summer camp activities are offered, so everybody would enjoy it. And so far, you guys already had a session go through. We yeah. got a session that started literally yesterday. Yes, yes, yes. Was second the session. Then? Yeah. Ooh, second session. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, yeah. So this is our second week second week or third week yeah. Jeez, this summer's flying by it's going so um, quick <laughs> yeah um but yeah so we're on our second or third week um attendance has been great but we do have room for more so um we have a really large gym at hannah and friends we're really lucky and then a, t a ton of outdoor space so we do have room for more um we have camp going until august 4th so august 4th um is the last day but um we are anybody can sign up on their website. Yeah. And how does pricing look for this? Yeah, so it's 160 a week. Okay, so um, that's per session. That's per <laughs> session, yep. So um, that's Monday through Thursday. Oh, how wonderful. Yeah. Is there anything else you think our families need to know before they go and get their kids signed yeah, up? Yeah, yeah. Um, it's just a really fun and engaging camp. We can make whatever work for your child. So, and then this is yeah. a great way to kind of get introduced to the whole Logan, Logan. family yeah. too. Yeah. Is yeah. that a also kind of way that you get to meet some of the staff and also get involved with other activities? Yeah, of course. You'll be able to see our locations, you'll be able to see staff, um, and you'll get to meet peers as well, right? So that's something that's really important about summer camp is meeting, engaging with friends. So yeah, you hopefully these friends at yeah, camp. <laughs> yeah, so hopefully these relationships can um, move to other programs within Logan. Oh, and I love it too, the little sibling bond. I'm here yeah. for it. I know yeah. you've got siblings too, yes, so yeah. that's always such yeah, an important thing. Yeah, it is. Thing. Yes, it's very important. Well, Kaylee, thank you so thank much you. for coming yeah, in this morning. Thank it was you. great to see you. Yeah, you too. Oh my gosh, small world. <laughs> well, hey, everybody at home, this session, this next one is taking place out at Hannah and Friends right off of Hollyhock Road in South Bend. But of course, you can head to the logancenter.org slash summer camp for the full breakdown of future summer sessions, dates, and more. I'll have that under the Summer Spotlight tab.